Welcome to Fire Recruitment Australia. In this video, we'll be going through an aviation spatial reasoning question. So for this one here, we're asked which of the choices when you fold it will match the figure given. So what you have to do here is realize that each of these ones would be opposite each other in a cube, which means in the orientation they've given us, um, we can only have one of each of the colors that I'm pairing up here. So we need one of the oranges, one of the blue, and one of the green in this final figure. Um, I did it a little bit randomly. Um, if you look at A, that's okay, because that's orange, blue, and green in the A picture. In B, that would be orange, green, and blue, so that's okay. In C, that would be orange, blue, and blue, so that wouldn't work. And then in D, that would be orange, green, and blue. So that works okay. We then got to work out, are they in the correct orientation? So if we look at A, um, it would be these three shapes here. And we start from that weird irregular hexagon and go clockwise. It's going the hexagon, the circle, and then the cross. And if you go clockwise here, it goes hexagon, circle, cross. So it looks like A could definitely be the correct answer, but let's try and rule out B and D as well. So if we look at the three shapes here and go clockwise from the hexagon again, it goes hexagon, cross, circle. But remember over here, it was hexagon, circle, cross. So that's in the wrong order, so it's not B. Same with this last one. Um, if we check it again, it goes hexagon, circle, cross, and it goes hexagon, circle, cross. So D definitely could also be the correct answer. So now we need to work out how can we differentiate between A and D. So this is where we're going to have to look a little bit more at the details here and notice that how this little small part of the hexagon lines up with the circle. So if we look at A, it's actually like an elbow part of it that lines up with the circle. Whereas in this one over here, it's the small part that lines up with the circle. So that means D must be the correct answer because it's not quite orientated correctly in A. And that's all for this video.